searching for the good in our neighborhoods and each other. Not just finding what's wrong, but what's right. A true reflection of Cincinnati. Find the good in your mornings. Good morning, Tri-State. This is WCPO 9 News. We thank you for choosing us. I'm Evan Millward. Here's a look at some of the top stories at this hour. An Ohio man accused in the Capitol insurrection at the beginning of this month has been denied bond. The FBI says Donovan Crawl created a military formation with six other members of the so-called Ohio State regular militia to make their way to the front of the crowd at the door of the Capitol. Crawl faces several charges, including conspiracy and destruction of government property. He's due back in court next week for a preliminary hearing. Work to develop the former IRS site in Covington takes a big step forward. As it stands right now, the 23-acre property on the riverfront is in no shape for private development. That's why Covington hired two companies to demolish buildings on the site, tear up pavement, and remove environmental problems. It's a relief to see that we're actually putting our words into action when we said we want to get moving and getting this ready for the market. To that end, next week the city will seek to hire an engineering design firm to simultaneously drop designs for things like streets and utilities. Plans for the 23-acre site along 4th Street include a restored street grid, a levee park, a new hotel, and offices, retail, and residential. Another cold night for us and a chance of a little bit of a mess in the morning, Sherry. Yeah, we're already seeing those temperatures fall into the overnight. We're going to be into the low and mid 20s, and we've been tracking some snow that's out to the west of us. So some of this coming in in the morning will be some light snow, and then it will be a mix, a wintry mix, a little freezing rain in there as well. Temperatures are going to slide again into the lower 20s, and Overnight, we'll see a few isolated chances for a few snow showers, but in the morning through about maybe noon is when we see some snow, some freezing rain, and also some rain. During the afternoon, those temperatures will be warm enough for it just to be some rain. Temperatures will then hold in the upper 30s for us as we go into Sunday, and we'll see a day of rain on Monday.